What I do for love. Fuck! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> After about 20 minutes of fucking cleaning that up. Yeah. God. Jesus. Hold on a second. We spilt again. Just to relieve the pressure. It's concrete. All right. I think my my mic is good. Everything looks good on here. All right. So there's probably a disturbing echo. It's all right. Let's see if we can edit it out. Yeah. Maybe not. Maybe you don't hear it. Maybe you're lucky. Maybe I don't give a shit. Well, here we are. We're back in the fourth studio. This is the seventh studio. What? What? We've been in seven studios so far. Um, and in the past two episodes, we have managed to torture our tablecloth with both heat, now water. Or uh, uh, energy drink, sorry. You know, I'm, I'm glad that you... I'm glad that you take the, you know, as like a, together we ruined it. More than he fucking more, ruined it. More, most likely it was just me. <clears throat> wow. What is this? Well, it's the frog. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Candela wrapper. So, the carbon filler. On this episode of Cigar. <laughs> On C of cigars, of cigars of valor podcast, we have a special guest. Us, don't you love us? We're here again because nobody wants to do it. It's just us again. This table gets shorter. Nope. The exact same that it was. Oh, last we need time. to change the light. Yeah, if we could make us tan and beautiful and luscious. Hold on God a damn. This is <sighs> two months of tanning that just occurred. Oh, no, no, we're getting pale again. All right. Damn. How it is freaking. God damn it. Why? So, we had some disturbing things happen over the past 24 hours. Yeah. I don't know what they are. I was trying to figure that out too, but, you know, I was just going to go ahead and agree with it. I don't know. Uh, so, next week, event, El Dorado, finds the guys. That's next week? Wait, next one is like be there or just don't be there. Go do something. Go drink your beer. Go, you know, do something productive. Fuck. Yeah, like being at the event. That'd be nice. Mm -hmm. You know, let me move this. Just a tiny bit. I'm just gonna move it over. Just I want to let you know that we get to this studio about three hours before we shoot, just to adjust that. Works. Oh, God. All right. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Here's what I like to do. I like to go watch Two Girls, One Cup for three hours straight. And then I go sit down in the corner and daydream about it. Two Girls, One Cup? Yep. Dude, I love that video. Yep. It's my favorite video. If you ever want to get us something, get us like a mug with one of the main shots of Two Girls, One Cup. <laughs> yep, Travis. Actually, go ahead and just give it to his dad. Is that one? Yeah. 
Mm. You know what's really counterproductive is someone trying to end their life with a gun. They wrap their head in a plastic bag before they do it, trying to minimize the, the uh, mess. What the fuck are you talking about? But if they use a gun to do that, it's going to blow a hole in the plastic bag. It's going to cause a mess anyways. <clears throat> there was a movie I saw that happen. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, somebody killed themselves, mm -hmm. and then <laughs> with a <laughs> with a bag over their head, and you know this does look like a room you would execute someone. Anyways, what do normal execution videos have in them? They usually have a light, a camera. What else? Um, from my personal experience in them, uh, usually camera, <clears throat> like I said, light, not a backdrop. Usually someone reading a message in a really strong accent. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, I think we should put a chair just in here in the middle. Yeah, like one of the metal chairs with a little handcuff thing on it where they put the lock on. Yeah, it sounds like a plan. Yeah, we can get one. And then, uh, never mind. I don't know if we can do that one because mine's a little fucked up. <gasps> um, so, got the event next week. Mm -hmm. El Dorado Fine Cigars of Rockwell. We will be there from five to nine. Next Wednesday, uh, we're gonna have special deals. We're gonna have a raffle going. Uh, we're gonna raffle off a nice bottle of bourbon, and uh, it's gonna be a good time. Is this rain or is this from the fucking drink? It's from uh, rain. Okay. Because this table mat is soaked. I could only wonder why. <clears throat> Mm. So, after we've, so I've noticed the past several days, our sales through the website has picked up. Yeah, I have. Quite a bit. And I don't know if you're buying just to feel sorry for us. Yeah, we're going under. We're filing Chapter 13. Don't fucking, what the, f no, we're not. <laughs> no, we're not. No, we don't have debt, so we're not working. No, we are not in debt. We have not taken out a loan. We have zero debt. So you can't have debt without profit. Actually, that's pretty bad. <laughs> God damn it. No, we're growing. We're doing good. But thank you. We're growing steadily. If you're buying our cigars because of this, thank you. But there is one thing. Yeah. There, there is one thing I would like to ask for again. If you're willing to sponsor us or donate ammunition, feel free to shoot us an email at team at cigarsofhour.com. Team. Team. T-E-A. That's right. <clears throat> um, <laughs> has anyone mentioned the podcast? Does anyone watch it? No one has mentioned it. No. Yeah, I know. I feel like we've said things that are so outlandish that they're probably not. So, well, somebody would say something to us, but nobody has. Oh, well, man. Um, I'm sure there's people that we encounter in person that watch oh, like Jesus. Yeah. and they see us in person and they're like, there's no fucking way <laughs> yeah. those, people. those guys are fucking stupid. Well, that's what's going to happen at the event. Yeah. In Colorado, they're going to be like, ah, this is yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you don't knock anything the fuck over when we get there. Mm -hmm. The things I do for love. <laughs> God, that's great. So today we're smoking the frog. It's our candela wrapper. It's a candela wrapper with a Nicaraguan filler. And if you don't know what a candela wrapper is, Google it. 
No, I'm kidding. Uh, it's a Connecticut wrapper that is flash cured in a barn. So instead of hanging upside down, being tortured for ungodly amounts of time, they hang it upside down in the curing barn and light a big ass fire in the barn, close the barn doors and let the heat build up. And it flash cures it. So it locks in that green pigmentation and also locks in oils that are normally lost in the natural fermentation process. So it gives it a very distinct flavor. What are you doing? I smell the bonfire. <clears throat> what? Damn, the fucking table is all wet. So, if you notice the shirt I'm wearing, I'm going to go ahead and plug a cigar shop. It's in Fuego. Oh, it's the in Fuego one. Like shop. Yeah, yeah. This is a pretty cool shirt. Nice. Yeah. I don't wear it because, well, the one I got, that other one in Fuego University one. Mm -hmm. I don't wear it because um, mm -hmm. I'll soak it in about three seconds. With what? Pit sweat. So, in the background behind us, there's going to be some further changes happening soon. We're going to have a few subtle changes to the backdrop, such as we're going to have a shadow box up there with challenge coins in them, and a lot of police patches behind us. Yeah. So, if you want to tear the patch off your arm and send it in, we would love to hang it up on the wall. Yeah, we, uh, Florida Highway Patrol is already ahead of y'all. Mm -hmm. They sent us, not only did they send us a patch, but a challenge coin. I well. guarantee the firefighters are quicker at sending us patches than the police are. You started the war. No, no. Prove it. Prove that you're not. Not what? Slower than the firefighter. We'll take firefighters. He stuff. said that. Yeah, of course we will. He said that not me. If what's going to happen, we're going to burn our studio down with a cigar. And the firefighters are just going to take a little bit extra time. To... They'll pull up and just like, oh, we forgot the coupler. Yeah. Oh, oh no. We forgot the crew. Yeah. That's what that would do. Just like when a city council member says some smart ass comment about the police department and someone breaks into his car and steals his shit, then who does he call? The police department. So the guy who stole his shit. Mm -hmm. Not the cops. I mean, like, yeah. You gotta call a criminal to stop the criminals. Yeah. Well, it's the logic, right? Yeah, I mean, sure. So uh, we got the event tomorrow, but we, not tomorrow, next week. I'm waiting for a cough right now. But we also have an event coming up December 10th. It's a Christmas party at El Dorado's McKinney location. I'm assuming there's going to be eggnog. I'm assuming. I've never had that. A long period of silence. Never had eggnog. Well, I can't really drink alcohol. Right now. But one day I'll try. He's on probation. Mm -hmm. I'll show you the ankle monitor, but I can't lift my leg that high. Here's the deal. Um, we need to go to the gun range. Any, you know, the smoke in here looks really cool. Any. There's no smoke detectors in here. Is there ones in the other one? <laughs> but never went off. <laughs> there's uh, also absolutely no way of ventilation in here. It's all right. And there's a monsoon coming down outside. Hey, apparently, we're, there's like a tornado watch outside right now. And here we are. Yeah. No, we should do the podcast. If a tornado came through here, we will do the podcast through the tornado. 100%. Yeah, I mean, I would just sit here while nothing's going on, and then just, everything's gone. <laughs> you don't go live on Instagram. Right now, we're in the middle of a tour. The cigars of Valor Storm Chasers. 
Oh, Jesus. Yeah, we'd be up. We're in the middle of a storm. It just cuts out. Can you imagine us as storm chasers? The phone, the phone comes back on. It's on 75. Yeah, nothing about tornado anymore. Oh, oh there it is. Tornado watch till 5 p.m. Or, sorry, 8 p.m. Wow. It was, it was till 4 p.m. earlier. Wow. But I forgot everyone's attention span is only like four seconds, so they have to extend it every 20 minutes to we keep people about? engaged with the news. What? I don't know. Fuck. No, I'm just talking know. shit. What was Generating that? content. What I'm, I'm, I'm what was talking about? I don't know. I don't know. It's just one little fucking piss ant oh, Yeah. Do any of that. that's, that's what so doing. there's one thing. Uh, back in 2015, we got pretty fucked up by an F4 tornado. Oh, I remember that. And uh, since then, every time we have one little rainstorm, they issue, like, everyone freaks out and saying, oh my God, we're going to have tornadoes. Oh my God. There was that <clears throat> tornado in 2019. That, that, that hit, yeah, that was everywhere. Nice. And uh, it did some damage, but everyone's freaking out from that. And I'm like, 2015, the tornado hit. 2019 was four years later. It's 2022, three years. We got one more year. The tornado will hit next year. Don't worry about this year. Jeez. Yeah, calm the fuck down. Yeah. God. Uh, they actually said that, you know, we, we grew up in Rowlett. So, like, Apparently, Rowlett is on the like Dallas is like where Tornado Alley is. So there's always like a perfect little current of wind that blows up through Garland and Mesquite and comes across Lake Ray Hover. And there was always tornadoes on that peninsula area of Rowlett. And um, they actually said recently that Tornado Alley moved over. And Dallas isn't in it anymore. I don't know. Even though we still get tornadoes, yeah, but you know whatever. Whatever. Yeah. They said it moved over. These are also the same people that, uh, you probably shouldn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you were about to say, I'm just gonna stop. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't continue. Well, yeah. You probably could say it on Rumble, but you can't say it on YouTube. Yeah. How is it doing? I really hope the echo is not so bad that. Yeah, I think as long <clears> as you just look, keep your fucking voice down well, and not scream at 400 decibels. Do I talk that way? Let me clean my No, ears. but <laughs> no, when you're trying to dance with your fucking light and you knock it over. Well, I knocked my drink over. That's all I care about. The light's like 50 bucks. Well, if you want to have it's a screech. Fucking look at it. That. I could. I watched the door <laughs> bow when you screech. It was compression. <laughs> Do you remember the uh, thirty on six silence? Thirty on six. That someone was shooting at the restaurant earlier. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, okay. I got you. Metaphor. I thought you meant like what restaurant were we? <laughs> that that was going on at is uh, even a, a suppressed thirty on six <laughs> it was <laughs> fucking loud. No, I don't know. Oh, the, <laughs> they were slamming the freezer door. Yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> it sounded like someone like he shot under a pillow. I'm just kidding. That shit would blow the pillow. Over. Yeah, we were sitting in this restaurant having lunch earlier, and I guess the guy's beer wasn't cold enough. Something like that. And she said, and the waitress said, sir, it's on ice. I mean, it's cool. He could see the condensation on the bottle, but the, the, the glass was frozen. Not on ice. Yeah, he was being a bitch. Now I hope you're watching this. You listen here, you piece of shit. You fucking you sneaky fuck are right bastard. A cuck. Can you say boomer? Boomer. Boomer. <laughs> God. <clears throat> Ask if we can say the word. <laughs> uh, let me so tell we've been experimenting with YouTube Shorts, yeah. and yeah. Uh, yeah, that's all I have to say. I could have made it a more interesting story and exaggerated some time, but 
I did it. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Mm -hmm. Let me tell you something. You know what I like to do? I like to uh, go lock myself in a closet. <clears throat> <laughs> I can't even fucking finish that one. I can't do that one. Is that something to do with two girls, one cup? No, Brownie makes an. Uh, never mind. And what? <laughs> Brownie makes an. Uh, I'm just going to stop. Oh, damn it. Uh, Aren't you gonna do some shake or something? Yeah, I forgot, so I'll, I'll do it this week. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Jackson Brain. Oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> do you have like fatal Parkinson's? Hey, that's offensive. You know, anyways. No, I was going to say, I like to go sit in that closet and eat brownie bakes and watch Two Girls One Cup. Anyways, <laughs> did you know <clears throat> it is closer to 2050 than it is to 1990? Send all of your hate mail to his address. His address is seven Ryan at cigarlive.com. Send all of your hate mail. Ammo. Request for ammo and sponsorships. Minimum of a hundred thousand dollars. Team at cigarsofvalor.com. You know, when I used to like smoke hookah and I God, was nice you were cut. I was sixteen. At a hookah lounge. Anyways, what do you drive right now? What kind of car? It's irrelevant. Now, I want you to tell the, the, it's irrelevant. Tell the world what kind of car you drive. It's irrelevant because I haven't smoked hookah since Subaru. I was 16. I've never vaped. I've never done drugs. I take that back, but I've never done drugs. <laughs> Jesus. Anyway, I used to be able to blow smoke rings. Will I ever try it with a cigar? Probably not. Let's try it. Give it a shot. No, I don't feel like dying today. That's a good point. Um, so, this is like retro hailing. So, let me tell me something. Ask you a question. Oh, wow, something different. What do you think of the frog? The frog? Yes, well, I will say, despite so many people's opinions on how good this thing is, I think you don't have to point a gun at me. Finish it. Let me tell you. I prefer, let me just say that there is Maduro, Connecticut, and probably more in this, okay? In the spectrum of things that we sell. Yes. Yes. This is the smoothness and mildness that you would expect a Connecticut to be. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't have the bite of a Connecticut. Some, some don't, but a lot generally kind of have a bite to them. Okay. This is extremely smooth, though it's probably my third, fourth favorite cigar that we got. Mm -hmm. It is 